Welcome to the explosive John Lewis show. Vuz said swing. Let's say hello to John Lewis. Yeah, John Lewis. Thank you, Ron. Thank you, Ron. It's, very, it's very nice of you to come all the way from California, Ron, to co-host the John Lewis show. Yeah, thank you. But we have a very special guest here this evening. We have Saul Mambi, the super lightweight champion of the world. Who's that swing? Mambi. Yeah. <laughs> now, Mambi, you really don't look like a fighter, Mambi. Now, I'm supposed to. Now, you know, the, you know, the current issues about boxing, you know, uh, they're very uh, devastating in talking about the sport. I think they're hurting the sport because they think that every boxer gets hurt in the ring. Now, what do you, what do you think about that? I mean, why do they always show the dark side of boxing? Well, it's like the news. They always show the dark side of the news. But why is that? I mean, what, what Well, purpose? for number one, uh, they claim that boxing is very barbaric. But actually, we as fighters take it as a science. It's the art of self-defense. Uh, my travels around the world has proven to me that here in America, everybody is looking to see blood, see somebody knocked out, and to see somebody get hurt. People pay money to go see a car race. They don't look for the winner, they go to see an accident. Really? Sure. People will go to uh, the fights just to see somebody get knocked out. And um, that's just, those are fans, so that's it's, the public. So it's really not the fighter, the fans, have, they have a lot to do with the, uh, the sport, I mean. Oh sure, the fans make the individual. If the fans did not back a Muhammad Ali, Muhammad Ali would have, wouldn't have been as great as he was, wouldn't have had the popularity that he has. All right. So they would enjoy seeing a knockout rather than a decision by you? That is in this country, but in other countries they go for the art of it. It all depends on where you're at. In South America, they go for who's the toughest. In America, they go for who hits the hardest. Oh. In Europe, they go for who is the classiest. Oh, I see. And that's, that's you know, different strokes for different folks. Yeah, that's interesting, Ryan, Very interesting. About mm -hmm. how different countries approach the art. Mm -hmm. Now, in these other countries, do they discuss about uh, doing away with boxing in these other other? Uh, well, some countries, yes, uh, discuss about doing away with um, boxing, but um, I guess now here they're talking about doing away with it, which is. Ridiculous in my book. Yeah. Uh -huh. Take a guy like the current heavyweight champion Larry Holmes. He would have never been a multi-millionaire, as we all know. He dropped out of school in, in the seventh grade. Mm -hmm. Now, in uh, society today, you know, you have to have um, college degrees and whatnot to make it. But there is so much um, going on now that you can have hundreds of thousand dollars worth of degrees and education and no place to apply it. When a man uses his physical body to maintain a status in life, whether it's barbaric or not, they're going to knock it. 